Now let's see the new topic that how metals and non-metals react with each other. According to the valency point of view, metals have one, two or three valence electron in their outermost shell and non-metals have five, six, seven electrons in their outermost shell. It means metals have to lose the electron in order to complete their octet or duplet. On the other side, non-metal have to gain the same electron in order to complete their octet or duplet. So metal donate the electron and the non-metal accept the same electron and bond is formed between the metal and non-metal. When there is a complete transfer of electron from metal to non-metal, the bond is called ionic bond or electrovalent bond. Now let's understand this ionic or electrovalent bond with an example. Let's take aluminium chloride. We know the symbol of aluminium is Al and symbol of chlorine is Cl. The atomic number of aluminium is 13. Electronic configuration is 283. It means aluminium have 3 electron in their outermost shell means 3 valence electrons. On the other side, chlorine is Cl having atomic number 17, electronic configuration is 287. It means chlorine have 7 electron in their outermost shell. Now aluminium have 3 electron. So in order to complete its octet, they have to donate 3 electrons and chlorine have to gain 1 electron. Means chlorine only take 1 electron, but aluminium have 3 electron. So 3 chlorine atom come close to aluminium and take 1,1 one, one electron and there is a formation of aluminium chloride that is AlCl3. Let's see the another example in which there is a calcium oxide. Calcium symbol is Ca, atomic number is 20. So electronic configuration is 2882. So the valence electron are 2 for calcium. On the other side, oxygen is having 8 electrons. 8 electrons means 8 atomic number. So, electronic configuration is 2, 6. So, valence electron are 6. So, in order to complete the octet, calcium have to donate 2 electrons and oxygen have to gain 2 electrons. So, both the needs are fulfilled. So, calcium donate both these 2 electrons to oxygen and there is a formation of calcium oxide that is CaO. In this reaction, only one oxygen atom is taking the part. 